Hello everyone, MP Hater here, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Final Fantasy VII Remake. This is Part 6, Chapter 6. And we are basically on our way to bomb another reactor. So this time we are going underneath the plates in order to get to the reactor instead of above the plate. So again, the rich are above me, the poor are below me. Literally shit flows downhill. We're going to go ahead and buy up a couple of things. I'd like to buy... Uh, I'd like to have everyone with leather bracers at this point. So I'm going to go ahead and equip... And with a leather bracer... And we're going to go ahead and equip the metal knuckles as well. Uh, let's see. Set upgrade settings to attack. Prioritize attack. We'll go ahead and sell both star bracelets. Buy a third leather bracer. And give that to Tifa. Let's see, we'll go ahead and give her healing materia. Uh, we'll give her first strike. Revival. We're going to make Tifa the leader for now because uh, that's going to allow us to get her ability done quicker because she has overpower that we can learn from this gear. Sell the, sell the star bracelet. Actually, we probably don't need that many antidotes. Sell five. The rest we'll go ahead and keep, I think. And are they selling any materia? Okay, we have poison now. That can be useful in some situations. All right, so I guess we'll go ahead and progress. One thing I don't like about this game, though, um, I mean, that I wish they would change, not necessarily don't like. I wish you could actually change who you are, who you are following, because we're following Cloud right now, even though I have Tifa as the leader. Whenever we enter combat, she'll automatically be selected, and it's a little strange, a little, a little odd being uh, suddenly switched over from one character to another. I hope they fix that in the rebirth game. No 
good? Needs power, I think. That looks more like what we need. Control room. Let's check it out. Maybe no one uses that entrance. I'm getting the feeling no one's come down here for a long time. No plate inspectors, huh? Shortage looks like insufficient power to me. Error. Insufficient power. That's fair. Of course. Hey guys, look at this. Instructions for dealing with a power shortage. Kill the lights, and we free up power for the gate and other stuff. Sun lamps. You think these are the plate suns? The closest thing we have to the real thing. Gotta put out a sun just to open a gate, huh? But if we go through with it. The grounders in Sector 4 will suffer. Now or later, sun's going out for good when we blow the reactor. That's true. Let's go. All these lamps. You'd think they'd be able to balance the load by now, though. Maybe. If the maintenance guys or whoever were playing hook. The lamps are important. But when you think how much Mako would like to hit you, that's gotta be one. Man. The size of it. That a console I see near the top of that ladder. They are pretty tall that too. I'll go. <laughs> we'll wait down here. Tifa does seem like she's starting to become more impassioned because it's, it did seem like she wasn't as invested in the idea of blowing up reactors. So I got some potions. And nothing over that way. Emergency power supply confirmed. Disengaging locking mechanisms. Okay, that's that. <laughs> Great job, Cloud. All right, let's go. Next stop, Section G. Yep, and after that, Reactor 5. <gasps> Not again. Looks like we got to deal with some enemies. Great. I'm sure those things will welcome us just as warmly as before. So, tell you what, the rock runs deep in this damn pizza. <laughs> All right, so pretty much we just got to do overpower and then immediately attack again. And as long as we do that a couple of times, we'll be able to gain the ability. Overpower. Overpower. by the Marco, but it all goes back to shit. Nothing in those boxes.
You okay? That was close. Yeah. Ah, going for that material, weren't you? So close, and yet so far. This path's no good now. I'm sure there's another way to get there. Hmm. Nothing we can do but search. And when we find it, we can finally snag that material. More materia down there. Okay. Unfortunately, I didn't spot a connecting catwalk to section H. Did you? Well, we could always do another lap. Go for ten, why don't you? The only other route that I can think of would be. Along the wall. Up for giving it a try? It might not work out, but it's the only idea I've got. It's not a bad one. So we're shooting for those giant fans way over there? Okay. At least we've got a clear landmark to guide us. Those ventilation fans? Keeping the plates air clean by pushing the smog into the slums. Whole system's designed to make shit roll downhill fast. And ain't that the truth. We haven't gotten that way though, have we? I don't think so. Or did we? I don't think so. They're mine. <laughs> All right. Good luck, man. Gotta be smart. There we go. Got the overpower ability now. Alright, so now we got the ability. We don't really need to worry about change battle settings. Go back to Cloud as our leader. We'll swap only when we need to at this point. You know the best way to not get lost is to believe that you're not. With mine over Max. Isn't that from one of Marlene's books? Yep, one of her favorites. Loves it when I read it to her before bedtime. Doing all the voices. Life in the endless maze. Am I right? <laughs> I remember. These things aren't active yet. I bet they're going to be, though. How do we get over there? Like, we have to go around. I think we can clear 
climb onto that pipe. Sure seems that way. No fear, no fear. Yeah, no fear. No fear. No fear. Clear. No fear. Little fear. Hey guys, um, you know, these fans are really loud and you chickening out? Hell no! I'm just worried that your pony ass is gonna get blown off the side and shit. Enough! We gotta keep moving. Okay then. Follow me. <laughs> no worse than a windy day, huh? One with a tornado warning, maybe? Don't look at the fan. Whatever you do. Right. At the hey, summon material. Tifa told you not to look at the fan. <sighs> Made it through in one piece. <sighs> Think that took a couple years off my life. <clears throat> uh, I mean, uh, not really. A couple seconds, maybe. Three tops. Section H is just up ahead. Slow and steady, guys. Then that's our objective? The cargo platform? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the one. This is it. This is our main objective, I think, for this, um, Let's not keep him this chapter. three lights worth looks like but that's that's all of them isn't it all or nothing let's regroup here if we get lost remember the h1 sign right let's see now closest light ought to be that one <laughs> by the light of these magnificent lamps we shall lead our brothers and sisters of the Undercity to a brighter future. Say what? It's from a speech President Shinra gave, talking up the importance of the sun lamps. <laughs> brighter future, my ass. Shinra's leading us down a one-way path to darkness and death. Gah! Go that way. Piece of cake. Too easy. Try this. So we don't have enough electricity Look, for that yet. There's the switch. Let's Anything over here? Go. Nope. How about over here? Hey, chest. All right, we'll go ahead and head back.
Rerouting power. Please wait. That's one down. Only two more lights to go. Reinitializing intrusion prevention system. Intrusion prevention? Back online because of us. <laughs> no need to fret, y'all. A few rusty mechs ain't gonna keep us from reaching the reactor. That seems to be the direction we want to go. Again, let's go off the beaten path and see if there's anything else over here. Probably some items in those boxes. Maybe there's a crate as well. Nothing in the boxes. There's an item around the corner though. What do we got? Uh, turbo ether. Well, uh, that's a stronger version of ether. Gives us back some of our magic power. Think back. Anybody see a connecting catwalk? Yeah, lined it up perfect. Which way to the next life? If we can't make sense of this place, we're gonna get lost. Well, at least we know where the big ass things are. Bring it on, assholes! Get ready for it! Take the lead. Okay, let's go! We got ourselves a real piece of work right here! <laughs> you don't know the half of it. Ain't no thing! Bring it! Oh. We're going backwards. My bad. There's that material we were trying to get before. on that side. Anything on down over here? Nope. Okay. And that's light number two.
And that makes two lights down. Meaning we've only got one left. The end's in sight, y'all. Should be able to climb down from here. Uh, this is a hole, right? About the sector four slums down there? Huh? You want to check them out sometime? I can show you around. Better check them out now if we fall. Let's see, how are we getting down there? The power's on. I guess using one of these. Actually, no, this goes across rather than down. Huh, okay. I guess we go have to go all the way around in order to get down. Oh, we gotta get up. You think they'll miss those three plate sons? Go up to get I down. Say the real sun's the only one we need. To hell with Shinner in this night light. Intruders detected. Engaging countermeasures. <laughs> Let's finish this. These things do not lack electricity. Too bad. Go ahead and scan them. Make sure we did. That goes up. We're right back where we started. Hmm. Where was that last light again? This looks like it's active now. Almost done. It's a shame we had to wander around so much. Well, no stamps here to guide us. No Jesse or Wes to back us up either. Yeah. Speaking of which, what should we tell Biggs? I don't want him to worry. Just have to make one. All right, let's check out what's over here first. Really? Nothing? Okay. This will be quick. Yeah. Huh. Dolly! Let me handle this. <laughs> and what are you? Going in. 
There we go. Merrick is that increased magic defense at the cost of physical defense? Okay. to the H1 sign. I hope that Jesse's injury isn't anything serious. The best thing you can do to speed her recovery is to kick Shinra ass in her stead. I know. I know. And Cloud's got a cover for Wedge, too. Still gotta go get some items we before we can H1 progress. Sign. We better assess these. Allow me. I don't think we've seen these things yet. Because they were kind of a boss before. A certain amount of damage. Okay, Not, nothing crazy then. What was it? Sweetness? Ice. Okay. Gotta be careful. Uh, let's heal ourselves. Oh. Oh. Well. We'll do raise. Shake it off, okay? We gotta kill one of these things as quick as possible. Probably use the block button more often. Not 
Okay. Huh? It's up, y'all. Magic power up. Mental materia. That allows us to tie a elemental damage to our weapon. So now we got to go get that summon materia. Get ready, Marco Reactor 5. We're coming. Buy a few of those. Now we have HP material that we can purchase, but it's expensive. Does this control the fans? Looks like it. We stop it. Switching ventilation system to maintenance mode. Please complete the maintenance access procedure within the designated time limit. Man, what are we even doing? Right. Watch it, learn. Yeah. Yeah. 
gloves up. Crap. All right, cool. Okay. What? What is this? Ch uh, Chugabo and Moogle. Material. Not a great materia, but it's got its uses. And I'm a completionist, so I, I always try to complete these games 100%. All right, so we should have everything that we need now. Let's get the hell out of here. Wonder what the reactor's like. Oh, this a slaughterhouse where he put to the plant. Then there's the smell. Marco, be ready for it. Right. Hear that, guys? It's the reactor calls. Back in the safe. Bring it on, Avalanche. Let's raise cloud. Can you fight? Shake it off. Come on. Back to the 
Damn it. Damn, my timing is just fucking awful. Hopefully we get a rest stop okay. before we be for us up ahead. end He's up in a boss fight. Being a terrorist, I doubt you get used to that. <laughs> Wait, Cloud, where's Jesse and Wedge? Report Top Side's going nuts after some terrorists jumped off a train. Nice and quiet here, though. So quiet, I had no trouble securing your route into the reactor. You magnificent son of a bitch! Bring it in! So, where are the <laughs> others? Man. Jesse got hurt and couldn't make it. Bad? Not so bad she couldn't rope in this guy. <sighs> Thanks for stepping up. It's a job. Worked out pretty good. You picking that train you did. While Shinra scours Sector 4, you can waltz right on into Sector 5. It's a bit of a squeeze, but it ought to get you where you need to go. Little dark and foreboding for my taste. Beggars can't be choosers. Oh, and you'll be needing your grappling guns, of course. All set. Ready to take on a light the machine gun obtained. So. Make sure everyone gets cool. clear, okay? So we got a okay. new ability to to try to gain of uh, ferrets. So you don't lose them. When we're done, we'll be using these babies to get down safe. All of us. Got it. <laughs> Look to the left. The left. Wait. Hurry it up. Fix those lights. <laughs> 
tights. Excuse me, sir. Your tie? Quickly now, quickly! with that i think that's gonna wrap it out everybody so we have uh made it into reactor number five and we're gonna wrap that out into or we're gonna wrap that up in our next episode as we reverse into the seventh chapter but until then thank you everybody for watching please like subscribe and comment and as always i'll see you in the next one later